There's nothing like getting a fever blister the day before you want to record a video. You know what? I'm going to do it anyway. Roll the intro. So today I want to talk about something I say in all of my videos as my closing statement. Stay focused on your dreams and I'll see you next time. There's a lot of motivation out there, whether it's on calendars you wake up to with phrases and sayings, there's friends, there's motivational books, there's YouTube videos, and there's fellow creators, vloggers like myself that want to push you to follow those goals of yours. We all do it a little bit differently, but it's the same tactics. Uh, a guy I met, you may know him, his name is Cody Warner. Um, great guy, fantastic guy. He's He's exactly who he is on camera. He's outgoing, he's funny, he's sincere, and he has that drive. And you know, last year he did a, a vlog every single day. But to see that glazed look in his eyes of, of concentrating on what he had to do, the one day that I met him was impressive. And what I walked away from meeting Cody with was basically, you have no excuse but to excuse yourself. He made sure he made a video every single day that was working towards his goals. He was focused on his dreams. You get it? So on his channel, Cody has a movement. We're all calling it a movement because it is. It's something we can all relate to. It's called hashtag no small creator. What Cody encourages you to do is to be a doer, to do something. And for him to throw that motivation out and for me to leave you with stay focused on your dreams, I know there's somebody out there watching these videos that doesn't get it, that they don't understand what the next step is. I want to explain to you my quick little story so you'll understand how you should apply it to your own life. Nobody's next step is the same for everybody else. So no, we can't give you that next step. All we can do is encourage you to stay on track and to not quit. And if you're around haters and negative people, find new friends, find areas where you do fit in. Be around, be around groups that understand what the grind is because they love it every day, because every day is one inch closer to their goals or their dreams. For me, it wasn't always photography, believe it or not. I was a musician in high school. I was a drummer, percussionist, marching band, jazz band, rock band, competition. I did it, even lettered in music. But it was not meant to be as far as my career. I didn't want to teach music. I didn't want to teach blickem, blickem, blickem on the drums. I wanted to be the performer. Well, in the midst of my what am I going to do a buddy of mine had a camera, I borrowed it, it was all filmed back then, we're talking about 91, 92, and I fell in love. I fell in love with how hard it was to create something that looked good, and I got addicted to the process. Very long story, very, very short, was that I met other photographers working at a one hour photo lab just to be around the photography somewhat world. I didn't even know where, where to go. Think about your daily routine when you were 23 years old. Your only goals in life back then was going out, partying, you went to school because you had to, and if you were going out to a career, fantastic. But if you weren't, every day you woke up, you felt like you had all the time in the world because you're 23, right? Okay. When I was 23 years old, I decided to start my business. 23. 23 years old, I started GK Photography. I went down to the big building where they like to take your money and give you little numbers that e equivalent to your business license. And you learn about insurance that you need, you learn about liability, you learn about sales tax, state and federal. You learn really quick that this fun craft as a business is hard. It's very hard because it's something you love doing. You would do it for free if you were a millionaire. But you're not, if you're like me, I have to charge money. I have to create a business. I have to be around those who can show me how to do good business. This is how I stayed focused on my dreams. I wanted to be a photographer until the day I died. 
Unless, of course, I won the lottery and I can do this for free and I won't be working every single day because I don't have to. And I can just enjoy my family and go visit Sonny in Ireland. <laughs> 24 years I have been doing this. I have been staying focused on my dreams by understanding one little thing. It's huge, but it's actually one little thing. Every single client you have is an inch more forward towards your goals. You may be telling yourself, but GK, you're, you're in business. You're providing for your family through photography. You are living your goal. I am, but your goals change as you get older. Your motivation grows. Your inspiration changes. You want, you want more. Don't we all? All creators want more. And I, I bet you any money, if you can sit Casey Neistat down and ask him the one question, are you finished? Are you fulfilled? He would tell you, no, we're not. True creators are never done because we enjoy the grind of figuring it out, making it work, next step. So you never get to a level where you're done. You get it? So staying focused on your dreams is something we all motivate you to do, but you need to figure out what that path is for you. I can't give it to you. Cody can't give it to you. Nobody can give it to you. You could admire other people and want to be like them, but their journey is not yours. That's all I got, man. So. Today's vlog is just gonna be me talking to you. Tomorrow, I've got some really cool stuff I wanna show you. But today, I just wanted to motivate you to literally stay focused on your dreams. And if you didn't know what the heck that meant, hopefully this video ironed it out a little bit for you and maybe you understand a little bit more. We're gonna be talking about this a lot on my channel because it's important. It's important for me to motivate you because I cleared the path to get to where I am, and now I wanna show you how to get there. It doesn't do humanity any good if only one person gets to the top. You got it? We all need to get to the top. We all need to keep teaching. We all need to thrive and succeed and motivate and kick the negative out the way. Yeah, that's how I'm gonna leave this. So look, proper closing. Stay focused on your dreams, and I'll see you in the next video, okay? I would love to hear your thoughts in the comments. Seriously, y'all, I love to read y'all's comments and respond, and having some kind of a conversation makes me very, very happy. So to all my subbies out there, peace! See you next video. I can't believe I'm doing this video with a stupid fever blister. Today's video is sponsored by Abriva. <laughs> no, it's not.